Welcome guys, an update 2.1, Scar L has gone through the weapon improvements and modifications, and it got slightly better now. So let me show you, what are the Scar L's new updates. The first thing we will be looking at is the new damage. So before the update Scar L, M416, AUG, all these guns shares the same damage, but now in update 2.1 Scar L's damage has been changed, it got increased by a very small amount approximately 2.5%, it's not a big difference. But this separates the Scar L from M4 and AUG etc. So what can this extra 2.5% damage can do? Or how will it help in your gameplay? Well more damage is always better, and in this case, this extra 2.5% damage will give Scar L the ability to kill a level 2 vest player in just 4 shots. Previously it takes 5 shots. So this is the new advantage for Scar L over the M416, because M4 also takes 5 shots to knock down a level 2 vest since they used to share the same damage before. Also in the long range scenarios, Scar L has that higher damage advantage, and it gets better at long range, because in update 2.1, Scar L's damage drop off due to distance is improved which means it can now hold off its damage pretty well even at long distances. And the next thing is recoil, PUBG mentioned that they have reduced the Scar L recoil, and there is a lot of rumors saying Scar L's recoil is better now and it has no recoil, etc. But let me tell you that I have done the recoil comparison between old Scar L versus new Scar L and I barely noticed any difference. So I did a deeper recoil analysis and I found this. So there is a 5% horizontal recoil reduction on average, and for the vertical recoil it's barely 2%. So there is a tiny amount of recoil reduction which is mostly horizontal recoil as you can see from these recoil patterns. So now you must be thinking is Scar L recoil better than M416? Well here's the side by side comparison between M4 and Scar L's recoil. Obviously, by looking at this, you will say Scar L recoil is better, which isn't completely true, because M4 has higher vertical recoil by about 5%, and this recoil can easily be controlled by pulling down your gun more. Meanwhile the horizontal recoil is lesser than the Scar L by about 10% which is actually noticeable. If you pay attention to the left-right jerks in Scar L's recoil pattern, and this recoil is extremely difficult to control as it can go left or right unpredictably. So according to my tests, M4's recoil is still better than the Scar L, and these are the only changes that I have noticed for Scar L in update 2.1, and if you know any new changes to Scar L that I haven't mentioned, let me know in the comments. So here's my opinion about Scar L changes in this update. I would say Scar L is actually more powerful than M4, but still most people would pick M416 over Scar L even though it does more damage, because M4 is very well known for being a reliable weapon. I mean I can trust M4 all the time since it's very consistent in every situation. So will you be using Scar L from this update? Or still gonna stick with the M416? Let me know in the comments. Anyway that's all I got for this video I hope you learned something new. If you did hit the like button and subscribe for more upcoming videos like these. See you guys in the next one.